from the beginning with columns, you could add an image to the background. And then a year or so ago, we also added the option to add a video or a map to the background of blocks. And now we've brought that feature also to columns. That means you can add a map or a video with the image. Let's see how that works. I have two columns here. I'll select the column and then we go to the background. Next to type, you have the regular image setting and then you have video here, which is either a YouTube or a Vimeo video. I'll grab the share from any of these guys in YouTube, paste that, and then you will see it starts playing in the background. Now, this will be good if you have some kind of effect that you want to apply. I would caution to use it sparingly to make sure it doesn't look weird. And probably you need to add some kind of overlay just so that there is a little bit of separation with the background. If it is a map you so want, then go over again to the background, type, and then select map. And this one is very simple. Simply type in the address that you want. Use this sparingly and also very wisely, young one, because in a case like this, where you have all the text with a map background, it is really crowded and cluttered and it doesn't look good. If we clean it up a little bit and take all of this away, you can make it almost like it is a clickable map area with a button in it. And then things look a little bit more spaced than that clutter that we had previously. If the event calls for it, then you know you can add a map or a video background to columns.